thing is so clunky, but uh, I do a little bit of tuning. It uh, definitely got some yaga to it. It's definitely not as smooth as I remember it, but you know, things have changed over the last, you know, 10 years or whatever. I don't think I even do a coordinated turn towards myself. Oh, 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 oh. No, I'm out of practice. I can't even do on a, a rotation. There's too much going on, it's windy. Well, not here. Banks okay. Lots of input. Hold on here. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> it's a little bit more intimidating than I remember. Not enough room for me to do a nice little turn. I used to be really good to this thing, but you know. You can see if you're, wow, the remote, I'm, I'm actually putting in a lot of uh, rudder authority to balance it, so every, so I, it's almost like a servo needs to be adjusted, probably a ton of filtering, but I also know a lot more than I used to when I was flying this thing first, so let's see if I can get it dialed in a little bit and have some fun. be kind of cool to do some FPV with it, but. And this is a KK2. Those are DT720s, just running it on 3S. Those are like 20 amp ESCs, old school stuff. Just threw a little eight channel receiver onto it, just uses five channels. But I mean, the wind is not too bad with it. Those are like 11 inch uh, slow fly props. Plenty of punch. Respect the beast. <laughs> I'm not know we're gonna land this thing. I didn't think about that. Maybe I'll sit her down in the snow. I don't know. I don't think I can do it here. <laughs> okay, I'll take that. Quick little flight. Nothing too crazy. Some batteries. 11.7. .7. Alright, now for one little quick hover. I'm fighting it now. No, never mind. <laughs> Before anything bad happens. 